Let's take a look and see whether CF2Cl2 is polar or nonpolar. This is difluoro-dichloromethane. We'll start by looking at the Lewis structure. Let's look at the carbon and the fluorine bond first. So we have carbon here, 2.55, fluorine, 3.98. That's a big difference in electronegativity. Because of that, these electrons here that are shared between the carbon and the fluorine, they're going to spend more time around the fluorine. And that's going to make the fluorine more negative. So we have a polar bond between the carbon and the fluorine. Let's look at the carbon and the chlorine. So when we're looking at this bond here, this pair of electrons, again, carbon 2.55, chlorine is 3.16. That's still a big enough difference for this to be a polar bond. Not quite as big as the difference between carbon and fluorine, but this is still a polar bond. So overall, is this a polar molecule? And if so, which side of the molecule is going to be negative and which side is going to be positive? Let's visualize that for a moment. So when we look at the CF2Cl2 molecule, the chlorines are on the top. They're bigger than the fluorine atoms. We note that no matter how we arrange this, we're going to have the chlorines on one side and the fluorines on the other side with this tetrahedral molecular geometry here. And since the fluorines are more electronegative than the chlorines, this side of the molecule here with the fluorines, that's going to be more negative. The side with the chlorines will be more positive. So we'll have a net dipole. This will be a polar molecule. This side here with the fluorines will be negative. The side with the chlorines, that'll be positive. Let's go back to our Lewis structure. So to recap, we have this difference in electronegativity between our fluorines and our chlorines here, and the fluorines are on one side. That means this is a polar molecule. A common name for this CF2, Cl2 is Freon. It was used as a refrigerant quite frequently. It has problems in that it destroys the ozone layer. So it's being phased out or is phased out at this point. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.